When I checked out the last time, Stitch Fix again asked me if I wanted a quick fix. And you all know I have a hard time saying no. So I said yes. Hey fashion friends, welcome to my channel, Dress Like You Mean It. I'm Andrea and I love clothes. I love clothing subscription boxes, I love shopping, and I like to do unboxings and, and try-ons and all that kind of fun content. If you like that kind of stuff, then I hope you will hit that subscribe button. Hit the notification bell so you always know when I'm coming out with a new video. And um, leave me the like if you like this video. Thank you so much for taking part of your day to watch my video. I really do appreciate it. Okay, Stitch Fix. Uh, subscription styling service. Actually, the tape was actually broken when I got it. Not, not very secure here. Um, subscription styling service. They they usually send you five items. They have been doing this thing. They also send you a preview of ten items that you can choose your five from. And they've been doing this thing lately where they've been saying you can choose up to eight, and they will send you up to eight. Um, I haven't I haven't found that many. So send you a mailer to send back the things that you do not want. And I've got shoes in my preview. I picked one thing um, and I asked for, I said that um, I would be interested in a straight pair of white jeans and a red blazer because I was looking on Pinterest and a lot of cute looks with red blazers. Um, looking for a bomber jacket and yeah I think that's what I asked for so we've got shoes and they feel like pennies and, and then we've got a pretty big bundle here so lots of fun color I like that okay yeah that's the uh Oh, I like that. That's the uh, blazer that I that I picked from my preview. Get a note from your stylist. My stylist is Marsha. She's amazing and price list, which I try things on first and get my reaction to them, and then I look at the price. So let's take the bundle all out. Okay. So on top we have. Um, so this is another blazer, and this is by 41 Hawthorne, the Stella Notched Collar Ponte Blazer in red. This is more of a rust. Um, I, I want more of a kind of a candy apple red. I mean, I do like it. It's got cuff sleeves. Can you roll down the cuff? It looks like you can roll it down. It does not appear to be tacked. I like the collar. Uh, it's a nice weight. Does it have any pockets? No, nope, I don't see any pockets. So it's just not quite the red that I'm looking for, but we will try it on. Maybe I'll just absolutely love it. I like the material. Okay, and then up next is the Skyser Blue Henna Modal Scuba Blazer. Now, do you say modal or modal? I usually say modal. And it's in this pretty blue color. It's got some pockets there. It's got a notch at the sleeves. So it looks like it's probably three quarter. It's got a very pretty liner. Did the red one? The red one just had a matching liner. Um, so it's got that flowered liner and it's a really nice material. All right. Okay, up next we have by the Goss, the Marley Mid-Rise crop boot in red and I and they have a, a raw hem does the hem I guess um, I wasn't sure it was the same length I am going to say these are um, almost certainly going to be a no because I have a pair of red straight leg jeans and I have a pair of red coated jeans and I don't really feel like I, I want a third pair of red jeans in my wardrobe. So we'll try them on. But And then we have got Just USA Danny High Rise Cropped Straight Jean in White. 
wonder if they will be cropped on me because I'm only 5'3", so a lot of times things that are cropped uh, fall right at, you know, right at my ankle or foot. Um, they, they look like they, they might fit skinny. Um, okay, we'll try them on though. And then let's see what we've got in the shoe bag. Citrix does send shoes in a cute little bag that you can keep if you keep the shoes and they're great for travel. And oh, these are, these are cute. All right, what are these? Do they, is there a tag? Yes. These are Dr. Scholl's Madison Fun Sneaker in white. So they're white, but then they've got the red on the back and they've got like that, um, well, I don't know what you would call that, but around the base. So those are fun. That's the two of them. All right, let's, let's read the note from Marsha. Hello, Andrea, and happy spring. I searched high and low for some of the items that you requested, but did not locate any bomber style jackets in fun colors or joggers this time. There may be items in other warehouses that are not available for me to add. I did find a red blazer from 41 Hawthorne per your request, as well as some white jeans. Just for fun, since I needed two more items, I chose some red pants from Vagas and some really cute white sneakers from Dr. Scholl's and a white graphic tee. Add a white graphic tee for a great casual spring outfit. I don't wear graphic tees, but I have a white tee. Layer on a denim jacket as a light layer and you are set for a day of shopping or lunch with friends. I hope that you enjoy some bright pops of color as we head into warmer weather, so let me know what you think. Excited to see your video too. Enjoy, Marsha. Marsha watches my videos, which is fun. All right, I will show you my outfit of the day and then we'll try these things on. So today I am wearing these corduroys and these this kind of raspberry color by Cosmic Blue Love that I got from Stitch Fix. The top is, I can't remember who makes it, but it's also from Stitch Fix. And it's in this wine color. And I'm trying to decide if it's okay to wear these together, these two colors together. The shoes are BCBG Girls that I got from Nordstrom many, many years ago. And they're just a, a pointing to a really cute, flat that I, I just love and I've gotten great wear out of them. So I'm going to come up a little closer just so you can see and weigh in on whether or not these two colors go together. So that's my outfit of the day. Let's try on clothes. I have got three of the items on. I have the white jeans by, who makes these? Just USA and then I have the blazer on and the shoes. So um, I just put on a white tank top. I think this is a super cute outfit. Unfortunately, there are some issues with um, the pants and the blazer. Uh, and I will give you a close-up of the shoes. Let's talk about the blazer first. So it is doing some things that indicate it's not well made. It's got this kind of weird wrinkle here. And I thought it might be because the pocket was sewn shut. So I released those stitches, but it still is doing this like puckering thing. And the pocket, so there's like a stitch here. You can I think it's on both sides. Um, I, I guess maybe to give it structure, but the pocket goes below that stitch. So I think it's like deforming that. Also, the inside is turning out. So it's, and you can see when I pull it in, it just gets kind of bunchy there. Um, love the fabric. It, it's very comfortable. Love the color, but am not, it just, it looks poorly made. I think what I'm gonna do with this blazer, here's from this side, from the back, this is just a gorgeous color. And I think what I'm going to do with it is see if I can exchange it for another one and see if, if another one doesn't have those issues. Because on this side, it lays fine. There's no bunching. This is not, you know, turning out. 
And this side is just like awful. It's like mismatched. So that's the blazer. Let's talk about the pants. So they are supposed to be a high rise crop. And I said that a lot of times cropped pants on me hit, you know, at the ankle or below. And that is true of these. These are too tight though. I could barely button them. They're a size two and the pants I had on earlier <laughs> were a size two. So you can see it's pulling here. Um, not an attractive look. It's giving me major muffin top and that's the back. Um, the, you know, the straight leg is okay. It's, it's pretty snug in the thighs, but that's probably just because overall they are snug. Um, I think that the straight leg is a good look. It said it's a high rise, but my belly button's right there and it's right below my belly button. So that in my book is not a, a high rise. So let's look at the shoes. So these are the shoes and they're very comfortable. They, I'm trying to decide what I think of that, whatever that material you call it, around the uh, the sole, the base, whatever. I'm trying to, I, I don't know that I like that. Um, that's from this side. Yeah, having them on, I, I can't decide. And I cuffed up so you could see the red. I think, I think that's cute, but I do, think it might limit what I can wear these with. And that's with the pants not cuffed up on the other side. So I don't know, I'll have to give these a think. Okay, let's keep going. So I decided to just try the red blazer on with the white pants as well. And I think it fits very nicely. It's much better made than the other one. Does need a, a good steam. Um, let's see if the, yes, they, these do roll down. So that if you wanted it all the way down, if you wanted to cuff it up, those are the different looks. I think the notched area looks nice and just lays flat. It's really great blazer and it's just not quite the red that I'm looking for. I'm looking for more of that candy apple red. This is, to me, this is more of a fall color than a spring summer color. So, all right, we just have those red jeans to try on. So these are the Red Bagasse boot cut jeans and they are, they're fine. I, like I said, when I did the unboxing, I just don't really need another pair of red jeans in my wardrobe. I left on that white tank and paired it with this black blazer that I got from Front Door Fashion and some fun animal print knit shoes with a great big bow on them. Let me come up so you can see the pants closer. So these are a 26, which is essentially the same size as the white ones, and I had no problems buttoning them, although the, the hole, it was, tried to, it was hard to unbutton them to put them on because the hole was so small, but I did manage to get them buttoned um, without any problems. And you can see that there is, there's no pulling like the other ones. They're, they're pretty low, belly button is there, so they're like a, a mid, almost a low rise, but definitely not high rise, but these didn't claim to be a high rise. And that's from the side. That's from the back. The pockets do come kind of low on the back, but yeah, they fit fine. I think they look fine. I'm just not in the market for another pair of red pants right now. All right, let's do prices and a recap. Another great box. Um, so I'm not wearing the clothes I was before because I'm doing back-to-back -back unboxings today or try-ons. Um, so I, I wanted to try something on with the other top I had on and then ended up switching to this. Beside the point, okay. I thought that was a good box. Let's talk about prices. So this is fix number 88 for me. And the stylus pick subtotal is $378. If you buy all five items, you do get a 25% discount, which is awesome. That would take off $94.50. And that is actually more than any one item in this box. 
Um, I do not pay the styling fee because I have the style pass, which for $49 gives me unlimited styling for the year. And that got applied to my first purchase after that. So that would bring it down to $283.50. So up first is 41 Hawthorne, Stella Notched Collar, um, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> and that's $88, which I think this was a well-made blazer. So I think that is a fair price. And if it had been, you know, that shade of red that I was looking for, I would have probably gotten it. Um, also $88 is the Skyzer Blue Hannah Modal Scuba Blazer in blue. And this I did not feel like was as well made. And even on the on the inside, it looks different. On the, the wonky side, you can see it just, it's just got some wonky stitching. So I think what I'm gonna do is go ahead and um, see if I can exchange it for another one because I love the color, really like the material. Um, and yeah, the Just USA Danny High Rise Straight Jean in white, these were $64. And that's a good price, uh, but it was not a good fit. And then the Vegas Marley Midrise Crop. Oh, these were the crop. Crop boot pant. The straight jeans were not crop. So disregard everything I said about that. Uh, these are $68. And again, fit fine, just not in the market for another pair of red pants, red jeans. And then the Dr. Scholl's Madison Fun Sneaker. These are $70. So I will probably check around you know, it actually looks like somebody may have, they look worn. They, they look kind of dirty on the bottom, like somebody maybe bought them and returned them. Hmm, not sure how I feel about that. Okay, so that was my stitch fix. It's the end of March. You won't see this until April. I'm toying with the idea of either doing a no buy for April or ordering a front door fashion, which is like polar opposite. But good box, um, not sure what I'm gonna do with it. Let me know what you thought of it, what you think I should keep. And yeah, leave me a comment. If you like this video, give me the thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, I invite you to do so. It does not cost you anything. And again, thanks for watching my video. And until next time, don't forget to dress like you mean it, fashion friends.